I'm so ready for this. Oh. Okay, listen to me. Getting shot during the DEA drug bust definitely helped my street cred with car pop and his drug runners. I am definitely making progress. Well, what do you mean you're making progress? Um, uh, pff, let's, I don't want to say it a million times, but can we wait for Nadine and Nicholas to get here? No, no, no. I haven't even heard from either one of them, and I don't even know if Nicholas will remember about this meeting. You need to listen. I'll call him, okay? No, 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 actually, don't, don't, don't call him, because, no, oh, now that I think about it, uh, Nadine, it's no secret that she has a thing for Nicholas, and I've seen the way he's been looking at her lately, it's a girl thing, so trust me on this, if they want some alone time, they should definitely have some alone time, and it'll give us a chance to be alone, too, and I think that's all the better. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're not fair. What? Because you're making me the voice of reason, oh, and I don't want to be the voice of reason. I think that is good. God, I miss you. I miss you so much. I just sigh. I want to rip your car. Oh, good. Ditto. Mm. Ditto. Mm, let's go. Oh. You know we're in the back room of the medical yes, clinic. And I know. know. So what? It's face. risky. I don't care. Anyone could come in. Guess what? I like taking masks. <laughs> Do something! Help her! My mother can barely stand up, the pain's so bad. Alright, alright. I'm afraid. So try and stay calm, alright? Tell me what happened. What's wrong? I get bad headaches, migraines. Uh -huh. I took her to the hospital and, and they gave her this medication. Which hospital? Mercy. I, I need help, please. She started taking this medicine, and right away I could see something was wrong. Look at her. She's so pale. Okay. You following me? I think she might have been poisoned. I want full blood panels. Tell them I'm sending over samples of the meds. They have to go directly to the lab. No red tape. Possible poisonings for both of them. Get them both on IVs, normal saline, and the 500 cc bolus. So I'm going to send a squad car over to Mercy and get those meds confiscated. Get a list of everyone who took the meds. Full blood panel, please. Directly to the lab. No red tape. Thanks. That is unbelievable. There's how many other people out there are taking counterfeit drugs? No, no, no. It's worse than that. Patients aren't just getting useless meds. They're being poisoned. Miss Donev, these cold war theatrics are getting a bit much. Well, they wouldn't be necessary if your brother hadn't gotten Mr. Karpov's visa revoked. Well, I think my brother showed admirable restraint. You see, if Kai was my wife, Mr. Karpov's visa would be the least of his problems. And if he keeps making advances to my sister-in-law, I think it might detract from our lucrative business venture. Mr. Karpov's infatuation will not interfere with business. Mm, smoking like a woman who's in charge. I like that. Mm. Hope you're bringing me good news. Oh, yes, I am, actually. The doctor from the clinic, Matt Hunter, is on the trail for counterfeit drugs, and he thinks he has a lead. That would be the opposite of good news. Well, here's the good one. You see, there are many people associated with the clinic who might cause some difficulties. So the place is going to be the site of a very tragic and fatal accident. All right, let me think. Carpav has a product in the shipping. What he needs is someone to handle the distribution. And that would be the middleman, which would be Jerry. I'm convinced of that. Based on what? Seen him have a conversation on the docks with Carpov? Are you kidding me? That was not social. Jerry is a sociopath who would gladly take pleasure in poisoning people to make an extra buck. I am convinced of that, too. If you put your emotions in the way, you could wind up with nothing, putting yourself into danger. Listen, Lucky, I want justice, but I am not about to get killed over it, okay? You haven't seen any of the cargo you've moved for Karpov, have you? A decoy. It could be a setup. Okay, uh, fine. Then before I plan my next move, I need proof. Exactly. And I think Jerry's the key to that, too. Spencer. I'll be right there. What? Two guys, both holding Russian passports, were found beaten up and unconscious in alley. Looks like somebody's having a problem with Karpov.
Sam. <laughs> we get music at the most unexpected of places, don't we? What the hell are you doing here? 